talk about ways that you can do that. So pouring into yourself and then the power of your thoughts. Like this is always really uh, sticks to me because you know, what, what happens up here? I mean, this is where the battle is won. Right. This is where you wage the biggest war, your mind. Right, right. We have between 60 and 70,000 thoughts every day, wow. every single day. And science tells us that 90% of those thoughts are the same thoughts that we had the previous day. And most of those thoughts are negative thoughts. And so in order to change our lives and change our reality, it starts yeah. right here. And it, it starts with unlearning some of the negative and unproductive things that we were maybe taught and told when we were youth. And you say when you declare that I am enough, you no longer uh, blame your past, your parents, or even your circumstances for where you are today. Your past explains how you got here, but you decide where you're going. Absolutely, because what happens is when we understand that and we get that awareness, we no longer can stand inside of our story because mm -hmm. sometimes we become victims to our story. But when we recognize that everything has happened for us and not to mm. us, we can stand on our story and use that to catapult us to our authentic self and to our best self. And one other thing that I wanna to touch on this podcast that you've recently started. Yes. Uh, 2020 Black Talk, Conversations with My Son. It's issues that specifically talk about things that affect black men and black boys. Absolutely. Um, you know, I had an opportunity to speak to 100 uh, uh, lifetimers at the California State Prison. Most of them were black men. Mm. And one of the things that I discovered is that many of them were there because of childhood trauma. And so uh, the podcast is a podcast with me and my son. And it started because we began to have a conversation about what happened. Because one of the things that I discovered while I was at that prison is that most of the guys that were doing life came to prison when they were 16. Wow, still kids themselves. Yes. So I Am Enough is your latest book. If people want to uh, get that, where can they go? They can go to youareenoughnow.com mm -hmm. or they can go to Amazon. Okay, all right. Harold LaFall, thank you so much for stopping by. Good day, dropping some gems of wisdom. We certainly appreciate it. Thank you so much for having me. All right, you want to keep it right here. We got more Good Day coming back right after this. The time is 8.51.